What is up everyone, this is Afterbrow Machine Head from Afterbrow Gaming and a little type of different video today, but uh, hopefully it'll be a good one. I think it will be, I think it'll be pretty decent. It's just going to be an unboxing of the HD PVR 2. Right now I currently have a, I'll show you now, <coughs> I have a Rock Show game capture, which is uh, not HD, but uh, you know, it's, it's able to go up in uh, 1080i, but um, yeah, no, it's, it's not really HD, but it's definitely worth investing into if uh, if uh, you're just starting out YouTube or whatever. And you can get a HD version of this as well. But I went with the uh, PVR simply because uh, it looks easier to use and stuff like that. And it's <coughs> yeah, it just looks easier to use pretty much. But this is fucking awesome. It's served me well. I'll probably still use it, like if I want to record. Certain videos, I don't know. We'll find out when we. <clears throat> anyway, let's, have, let's just take a look at the box real, real quick. Okay, so basically, it just says a bunch of uh, shit, basic stuff. Um, game in addition, record, record and play your Xbox 360 and PS3 gameplay in HD, upload and share best games online, blah blah blah. That's a little bit blurry right there, but uh. Includes real time pass through, allowing you to play while you record and shit like that, pretty much. Uh, price, well, barcode at the bottom. <clears throat> Couple of the logos and stuff shows like a brief diagram of uh, what's going on the inputs, the HDMI cables, the outputs, uh, Xbox 60, PS3, and uh, PC or laptop. Shows at the back of it the features. For example, uh, let's have a look at red one earlier, which is pretty good. Uh, this is the one HDMI and component video in plus no delay. Uh, HDMI video pass through. That's what that says, there. And HD PVR2 comes with HDMI in and out to make it easier to connect to Xbox 360 uh, and your HD TV set. Blah 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 blah. And there's more description and it shows, uh, uh, what's it say, I read this, this video now I'm on about. HD PVR2 Gaming Edition comes with all the cables you need to, you need to connect to Xbox 360, yeah, Xbox 360 and PS3. And these are all the technical specifications, pretty much system requirements, and yeah. So I guess we'll just uh, get to opening and now I suppose see what the inside looks like and what exactly comes with the inside. At the end of this video, well towards the end I will do a comparison uh, of the Roxio and this. So you know, you know what the... See, the, see what the difference are. So yeah, let's just jump into this. So straight away as soon as you take the, the pretty much cover of the box off, you just get a uh, cardboard protection thingy. Um, Hold on a sec while I uh, pause it to open this. Okay, so we got the top open, uh, encased in bubble wrap, whatever the fuck it's called. You seem to have a hold on. You seem to have a plug, adapter, whatever. Uh, don't know where this is gonna go. Probably the uh, cap card may need some power. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't know that. I know the Rockstar doesn't. You just have to plug it into your Xbox or PS3 and uh, your PC, and it's good to go. Here's the cap card itself. Uh, apparently, well, no, no, apparently, I think it's, I think it's a fact that it's a lot smaller than the original HD PVR. Let me just pause this so I can take this uh, wrap off. So yeah, that there it is, pretty much. Uh, this button here, you can just uh, you click that, and the thing starts recording. So you don't have to mess around with like clicking anything to start recording on your PC. Uh, nothing else comes in that plastic case. Just uh, this. <clears throat> Don't know much to say about this. I know the that lights up whenever you're recording or not, whatever. But uh, yeah, this is this is gonna go right here where my original cap card will go, and hopefully you won't uh, have as many, you know, wires and shit flying around the place. So next up in the box, we have our uh, first HD MI uh, cable. Don't really need to take that out for you guys. I'm sure you know what the HDMI cable looks like. Uh, I seem to have some component cables here, or oh, I'm not sure. I'll have a look at that now. We have our second HDMI cable. Once again, I'm not going to take it out because you should know what it looks like. 
And we have a third one. Hmm. Final thing in the box is the instructions, I believe. Quick installation guide. Quick install guide, whatever. Whoops, something else fell up here. I think, yeah, that's the, uh, that's the disc to install it on your PC. <coughs> um, just let me show you a quick brief of the instructions. Hold on. Yeah, like I said, uh, I think that this, which is the component adapters, and this, the component cable itself. It's not really component cable, but for the PS3, I think, I'm not too sure, you will need... You will need this instead of just a standard HDMI cable, but this is obviously HD, uh, HDMI, but it just has these at the end, I think. You need this and these, the adapters, to go into the back of the cap card from, like, the, the PS3, that is, to the back of the cap card using these that go on the back <clears throat> to connect it up. But I think for the Xbox 360, you just need to just go straight with these the HDMI cables from here to the TV whatever and from here to the Xbox I believe yeah it has got yeah there you go it has got two HDMI cables at the back so uh, I think I'm probably right about that I'm not sure yet um, I might be wrong about the PS3 one I might be wrong about the Xbox one but I'll find out now I'll find out 100% obviously what you have to do for the Xbox but I won't find out 100% for the PS3 because I do not own a PS3 so yeah show you the in and out blah 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 I'm not gonna show you much of this because it's not a point because you can't really see it uh, quick uh, screenshot of the oh wait we have some more screenshots of the, um, the software uh, video inputs stuff like that pretty much so yeah <clears throat> I, may, I might show you a uh, might show you what the editing software looks like, but unfortunately I will have to show you using a camera because uh, <laughs> I don't have fraps or anything or any screen software recording, screen recording software, sorry, on my PC. <clears throat> so that's going to suck, but uh, you know, try my best. Try my best. Okay, so I'm probably going to pause it now to uh, just quickly install this and set it up. And once I've set it up, I will show you exactly how mine is set up so maybe you can you know imitate it or whatever so I'll, I'll see you in a see you in a bit all right so i gonna set up now i think well not really i think i know i'm doing the quality test in far cry 3 so so that, obviously that's it on my tv uh cap card is here um i think when this turns from blue to green or yellow, whatever the fuck it is, it's, it means it's recording. Um, so basically, this HDMI in goes from the Xbox to the PVR, and the HDMI out goes from, obviously, the PVR to the TV. And this has to be plugged in to a power supply for it to work. Uh, HD, no, not HD, sorry. Shout out to... First Metal God recently just got Xbox Live. Um, the USB goes right to the PC, obviously. You may notice I got the Gears of War sticker everywhere in my room. <laughs> Enough of that now. Alright, so this is the capture screen. Um, obviously, the same as what's going on on the TV. Um, it looks like it loads up not only with the capture screen, but the editing, the editing software comes with it at the same time. I'm probably not going to use this editing software since I got, uh, I use a different one that I'm happy with at the moment, but I might try it out sometime, but, uh, at the moment, it looks fucking lovely. It looks better than what it does on the, the TV for some reason, like, this, it's got more sharpness and stuff, I don't know. But the only problem is, I'll show you now, this, the rocks here didn't have this problem whatsoever. I move this, and then, or you know, it registers, and the same goes for the sound, obviously. <laughs> but it's it's not much of a big deal, but uh, I just like that about the rock show is very spot on and stuff I guess that's it for me showing you what everything is hardware and stuff anyway, uh, I'm just gonna Jump into the quality test now obviously I will show you the rock show first and then the uh, HD PVR all right, so <laughs> So 
this will probably be the last time you hear me speak in this video. So, thank you all so much for watching. Um, like I said just now, the Roxio obviously is not as good as this because this is more advanced, better quality and stuff. But the Roxio for its price, 100%, definitely worth getting. Such a good fucking cap card. Like, really easy to use, you know. The quality is really decent. And HD PVR. Well, you can look at reviews for it, you know, I'm just only starting out for it. This is not a review video. So, I might link a review video in the description below. Well, I'm not sure yet, but... Um... Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, thanks for watching. And, uh... Enjoy the uh, quality test. Mm-hmm. 